Welcome back, guys. It's that time again. SMB3 Warpless Seminar. Today's episode is going to be 3-8. And you know what? It's really not that complicated, so let's jump right in. You're going to want to start this level by running for just a little bit until you reach the second pair of eyes on the background bush. Whenever you reach that, you're going to want to do a full big jump to the next platform, and from there you can jump right away or you can run a little bit. It doesn't matter, whatever feels more comfortable. Sometimes it's better to run a little bit so that you don't miss your A press, you're, you're almost guaranteed to jump. You're going to want to jump past the turtle with a medium jump, and then you're going to want to jump again right away with a small medium jump to the next blue platform. From there, you're going to want to do a full big jump on the edge all the way up to the top grab block. And whenever you do that, you're going to want to grab the block, throw it right away, and then grab the next block as soon as you can. From there, you're going to want to run a little bit and do a little small medium jump to the taller platform of these three here that you see. You see a small one, a big one, and a small one. You're going to want to jump to the bigger one. And then you're going to actually want to neutral off of that platform to land on the smaller one and then do the biggest jump you possibly can all the way over into the water. During the full big jump, whenever you reach the peak, you're going to want to slide your thumb to start holding up on the D-pad to allow you to jump out of the water. So right now you should be holding up and right, so kind of like diagonally up. And as soon as you land in the water, you're going to want to jump right away and continue holding up and right the whole time and jump. You're going to want to do your biggest jumps possible. You're going to want to get to the right as far as you possibly can each jump. So you land in the water, jump, hold up and right, land in the water again, jump and hold up and right. The boss bass almost gets you but doesn't. Full big jump right away, up and right on the D-pad. And if you do it correctly, your last jump should land you on this block. If you land on this block right here, you're safe. Then you do a big full jump as you possibly can. You land on the next platform out of the water. Then you jump right away and you do a medium jump, land on the next platform. From here you can do a medium jump or a full big jump. It doesn't really matter what you do, but if you do a medium jump, you'll land on the ledge as early as possible, which means you'll build P-Speed as fast as possible. So this next section is a little weird because you're starting to build P-Speed off screen. Keep running and you're going to want to neutral off of this little lip here. You can barely see it in the top screen. You're going to want to neutral off and just keep holding B and run. And as soon as you land on the ground, wait a couple frames and then just do a full big jump as big as you possibly can. You can't see it, but there's three blocks blocking you right now in a vertical position and you're going to want to jump over them. And then you'll see yourself land and you just run into the pipe. So in this instance, you're going to drop you're just going to hold forward, rebuild P-Speed again, but don't neutral off the bridge here. If you neutral off the bridge, you're going to lose P-Speed. So what you want to do is make sure you jump one last time. It doesn't matter what kind of jump you do. You can jump early, you can jump late, small jump, big jump. doesn't matter. You jump, you land, and then you hit the card. Make sure you do a turn back. If you have two stars, which you might at this point, you're going to want to do a turn back into the card, allow some frames to go by, and then you, you hit the mushroom. And then that's it. This level's very simple, it's pretty easy. Now after we've gone through it, let's see what it looks like all put together. Well guys, thanks for watching and I hope you enjoyed. More importantly, I hope you guys learned something. This was episode 20. Next episode is going to be 21. We are going to be doing 3-9, which does feature the H-Jump. And uh, I hope you guys stick around and uh, thanks for watching. See ya!